It's another Friday. It's lunchtime. Let's spend your lunch checking out some new music. This is a band from California by the name of Mugshot. They're on Pure Noise Recordings. This is their newest song, Left in the Wake. Tim hasn't heard it. Let's see what he thinks. Go. Um, to me, think? not bad, not bad. To me, it's uh, it's like a. How am I gonna say? How am I gonna say this? It's like a weaker version of like uh, I can't even think of the band now. Chamber. Without chamber, without the math core parts. Yeah, exactly. Yep. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. I mean, it's they, they've come a long way. They were just a straight up tough guy band. They've gotten better. They've gotten tighter. Uh, they're on that, uh, by the time this episode comes out, the tour will probably be done, but it was the Born Dead Clothing Tour. It was with them, no branding rights, Mouth for War, uh, Downswing, and then Your Spirit Dies. But that oh, okay, is, okay. that. think of that lineup, right? That is solidly in this wheelhouse. But yeah, they're, they're not bad. I will tell you this, Tim. Check it out on Apple Music. PBR, <laughs> Paps Lurman, does a comp every year with Pure Noise Dead Formats. Where they oh, yeah, ever, yeah, yeah, everybody yeah, yeah. does covers. The uh mugshot covers get this, which is a song by Slipknot that I think it was a B side off the first album. I think you talking um, about get inside. No, get this is the name of the song. Get this. Uh let's see here. It's the 15th track on the reissued Digipacks, the 17th track on the original Digipack. And get the la- the final album, the final lyrics are like, "Suck, uh, uh, get this or die, suck these nuts," <laughs> and it's all about a, a band. Um, it's it's about some band that felt responsible for Slipknot's success, and they were basically turning around and giving them a middle finger. But the cover is really good, like really, really, really good. So if you like Slipknot, check it out. If you like this mugshot, check it out. But Tim, listen to that. And let me know what you think. I think you might like it. It's pretty good. How how do I not know get this? It was buried. It was buried in the track listing. Hmm. I'm gonna have to check that out actually. 
Yeah, that's weird that I've never heard of that. Okay. But yeah, I mean, yeah, not not a bad song at all. I've never heard anything else from them, so I'm gonna definitely add it in and check the rest of it out. But yeah, not bad at all. Sound it's like a it's like a light chamber. They have a um, diet chamber. (laughs) Oh my god, diet chamber. There's um there let me find the name of it. They did an EP uh and it used to show up all the time in Spotify. Hold on. It was uh stream left of the mic. Hold on. Every time we do a video, this will just friends comes up at the end. Hmm. Is that is that Sam? Is that Sam again from Hoyos? Nah. I don't remember the name of the EP, but it's it got a red the, and a blue cover. That um, might be the drummer from Cuyo. It might be. They it gets fed to me every time I listen to Spotify and I'm listening to hardcore. So check it out. But yeah, if you like this, again, pure noise, they can't go wrong. They're up there with Unique Leader is and 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 um Monarch Heavy is some of these labels that are really signed with a bunch of really great bands. So hope you enjoyed. Check these guys out. Until next week. Enjoy your lunch. Peace. Too bad we never do these on lunch. All right. <laughs>